going on YouTube? Chris coming at you with a new video. This is number 35. I don't know. I've been doing this for, uh, I think, two years now. Going on three. I don't know. I don't remember. Today I'm bringing you the 2010 for the love of the game Olympic 7s and the 2004 Olympic 7s. Doing a small comparison. I've checked both of these shoes out. There's not very much difference other than the patch really I mean I've, I've checked the quality out the quality is, is actually decent on these quality as far as you know the cushion on the inside the midsole everything is pretty much the same jump mans are the same jump mans are the same nine on the back nine on the back um, you flip them over you know jump mans are the same turn them to the front Everything's the same, you know, everything's the same. Even to the, everything is the same shoe. The only difference is this. This is actual stitched in. It's it's not just a, sorry. It's not just like a, a sticker or, you know, like just a paste in, I don't know. It's actually, you know, there. Shoelaces, the gold, comes with the gold laces. Also, just like this one, tags are different. The tags on the inside, this one is a Jordan sign. You know, this is the new Nike tag. This one is the old Nike tag, the made in China, that one. Um, same thing with the other shoe. It's all pretty much the same shoe. Let me just show you more in detail this, the new one. Got these a week early. They actually come out next week. They're going to retail one, 150. The old ones retailed, I believe, 135. I don't remember. I believe it was like 135, 130, 125, something like that. Um, yeah, I mean, the quality is good. I haven't tried them on, so I don't really know too much right now. They feel the same. I wanted to bring you this video. I know I haven't been around for a while. I'll be making new videos all the time. I got about 30 new pairs of shoes. Jordans, let me just show you a quick preview. Of course, Anniversary 3s. You got McFly SBs. You got the Retro 2s. You know, those are the Long Beach Dunks. This is this one right here, I believe, is a good pair. They're all getting ready to go to storage. I do, I have all my shoes in storage. Oh no, this ain't a great pair. What is the uh, Kobe's? If you're into Kobe's, I, I collect a few LeBron. These ones are some good Kobe's, the Chaos 4. Um, so yeah, so right now I'm just showing this video, letting everybody know that I'm I am gonna continue doing videos. I'm gonna do videos more often. Um just subscribe to me, you know. I mean there's a lot of new people with heat out there, more heat than me, you know, show what you got. You know, there's a lot of heat that I have that I haven't showed because I haven't had the time. I just wanted to do this quick video, you know, because I got the shoes a week early. I got them. They said they're supposed to be a quick strike, only, you know, or major accounts. I got these from a dude who doesn't have a major account at all. Um, I paid retail for them. 150 plus tax came out 165, 164 something. 160 is a lot, a lot for some shoes right now. I mean, they're not really like, there's not really anything coming out. I mean, I was looking at the computer today. I saw the, the candy pack, the Retro 2 candy pack. You know, the Daylights look good. I don't know about the other ones, but yeah, I mean, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let you guys go for now with this video and subscribe to me because I'm going to make a couple more videos. My website, people have been asking about my website, icysouls.com. It's in the works still. It's just I have so much shit to upload and i don't have enough time to do it all i have shirts i have everything ready to go i just don't have the time so you know it's gonna be heat there i'm gonna the reasonable prices i mean reasonable you know you people that are far out there that just don't have heat and want heat at decent prices you'll you know just check out my site keep 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 looking for updates soon as it's up i'm gonna make a video and let everybody know i just don't want to just launch anything that's just you know basic i want to launch something that's that's going to be good you know i just don't want to be like some other websites that are just like whatever and i'm going to be like more of a og stuff as opposed to generic retros um i'm hard to find things you know i'm going to try to find a whole bunch of different sizes but right now i'm i'm, I'm mainly looking at from size nine to 11 and a half 12 
so i mean if i find something at decent prices you know lots that's what i do i buy big people's lots definitely hook you guys up you know um so that's what it is so hit me up my shoes are real they're not fake please don't waste my time or make yourself look really stupid by posting a comment saying my shoes are fake because they're not fake they're real and don't subscribe to me if you think my shoes are fake because why would you want to see fake shoes all right guys